What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Quick video on how I send out emails, uh, specifically broadcast emails. Okay, I just dropped a new video um, 33 minutes ago. So my whole process on how I've been uploading these videos and distributing these videos, um, as I talked about on my previous videos, like a few prior to this one, just a couple back, I forgot which one it was. I think it was my first YouTube check. Yeah, I think it was this one five days ago, uh, my first YouTube check. What I was talking about was just my my lack of, of consistency when I first started my channel. When I first started my channel, I didn't really, I didn't know what the hell I was doing. And it, to be honest, I still don't know what I'm doing. Um, but shit, the YouTube money is starting to come. So damn, I'm going to keep it going. Um, but when I first started, I wasn't the most consistent by putting up these videos. And I wasn't the consistent on how to optimize it, how to add the tags, how to add the images and the thumbnails and how to share it on all the platforms and why it's important to share it on all the platforms right away. Like I didn't know any of that stuff in the very beginning. Like it wasn't until 2019 to tell you the truth. It wasn't until 2019 when I started really trying to focus on the tags, on the thumbnail, on the keywords and optimizing it the right way. It wasn't until the end of 2019 when I started doing that. So now I'm doing that and now I'm just taking little basic steps, stuff that I learned um, and just, just important basic steps to really launch your video, you know, in the beginning and just give it the, the, be the best chance to get the most views and be suggested by YouTube and, um, and all that good stuff. So this video right here, I'm going to kind of just walk you through how, how and what I do is once I upload it, what I'll do is I'll, I'll share it. So this is, this is it right here. I'll share it on all the different platforms. I just put together a free training on how you can use YouTube ads for high ticket sales. Uh, as you can for that. I'll press pause and then I'll just simply share it. And this is what I do. I'll share it on Facebook. I'll share it on Twitter. I'll share it on Pinterest. I'll share it on LinkedIn. And then I'll also email it. So I already shared it. And then what I do is I'll post a pin. I'll pin, I'll post something and then I'll pin it. Okay. That's what I do. That's super important. And then I'll also heart it, heart it. That's super important. Um, all the tags are up in there and then, and then I added a thumbnail to it as well. Okay. Now what I also do is I, I send that email to a handful of people that are on specific email list. This one's going to go to just a few people that are on one specific list and that's digital agency blueprint. So those of you that are, that are wondering how in the hell I'm building my agency, like what are my strategies? Like how do I direct message? How do I reply? How do I schedule appointments? How do I close people? get on that VIP list. That's digitalagencyblueprint.com. Um, I'll send you a few emails and just, and just make sure you check every single one of them. But I'm going to send this video to that list because this has to do with my agency. This has to do with how and, and different tips and tricks, you know, that I'm, that I'm, that I'm implementing. So I'm going to share it with that list and this is how I do it. So again, a lot of you guys are still using Oh, actually, let me, let me, yeah, you're still using multiple services for all this stuff. You have a service for your landing pages. You have a different company that you write a check to every month for your email autoresponder. You have a different company that's handling your membership course. You have a different company that's handling your, ca handling your calendar, right? I use Kartra for everything, man. So profitwithkartra.online, that link is in the, is in the description. There's a 14 day trial. You have to play around with this, man. So here's what I do. When I go and share that YouTube video to my email list, I create a landing page first. So I'll come in here and any of my landing pages, it's really, I already know which one it is. I just come in and I just clone it. So I'll clone it, which is duplicating it. And I'll just create same template, same everything. I'll just create a whole new video or a whole new page. And this is the page that I just created. So my whole intention is to is to send them an email, everyone on that list, and get them to click to watch the video on this page. Now, why do I take them to a page and not my YouTube channel? Why, why don't I just link them straight to YouTube? I don't do that for a couple of different reasons. One reason is there's too much going on. There's so many other videos. They're gonna click here and then all of a sudden be watching freaking Joel Olstein. You know what I mean? And so I don't want to distract them. I don't want to take their attention to YouTube 
and 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 distract them for, from for from everything else going on. Like um what I want to do is I want to take them to one single page where I have their attention. There's nothing else going on. There's a button down here, but there's nothing else going on. It's right here. They come here, they press play and they can watch the video for, for, from here. Okay. They can watch the video from here. Now, a couple, a couple reasons. Number one, I don't want to distract them, right? I don't want to distract them with all the stuff going on on Facebook. I mean, on YouTube. And then number two reason is because I want to really, track my visitors i want to know who the hell's watching like number one you're on my email list so you took the initiative and you 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 opted into my email list so i know you're interested in me somehow some way on what i got going on right that's 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 that that's one one reason to assume that you're into my shit but there's also people that are on my email list that never check the damn emails it's like dude why in the hell do you opt in when you're not going to check the email if you're going to opt in digital agent digital agency blueprint.com if you're going to opt in and, and and want my secret strategies check your damn emails check your emails so this right here allows me to really to really focus on the people that are that are checking their emails and how am i tracking that with my facebook pixel i send them to a page so i can facebook pixel them bottom line so when i when i go run facebook ads i can run it to these to the to this group because this is my mo my most engaged group, my people that are landing here. You're only going to opt in and, and, and check that email and come to my page if you're really interested in what I got going on. And those are people that I want to stay in front of. So when I go on Facebook, run Facebook ads in the future for a specific product, keywords for a specific product, I can segment it based on my pixel, based on who's actually visiting my pages, right? powerful powerful ninja stuff that you guys ain't, ain't 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 paying attention to you can't just run facebook ads to everyone on your list no man i got different people on my list for different reasons right i got different lists for different reasons so i'm bringing you here to one page so i can pixel you and then also so i can direct you to where i want you to go so not only am i pixeling you not only am i getting the view from the from the youtube algorithm that person you're still the view count is still tracking right on youtube so these views right here i just dropped this video let's refresh this i just dropped the video you know a few minutes ago let's see how many views we got just or just by randomly posting it right now it just posted 33 minutes ago but we're at um we're at we're at nine views we're at nine views right that's organically but now what i'm about to do is i'm about to um um email email it to my list and drive them to this page not my youtube channel drive them to this page i got all their attention on this one video they can click down here and they can see how i schedule my appointments using the Kartra calendar they can come here watch this simple video and then start their 14-day trial if they want so i'm getting the, the youtube view and i'm getting them to come over here which I'm in hopes of getting them as a Kartra customer and earning that affiliate commission. So you got to hit it on all ends, man. You got to hit it all on all ends. You got to upload that YouTube video. You got to share it on social media and you got to email it to, to your list and make sure that those lists are specific lists. Don't send a freaking, don't send this video to a bunch of people that are on your cat list. No, man, people that bought your dog product. No, dude, don't send them this video. That's not who you email, right? Your emails, your list should be very, very segmented and very, very um, niche specific and topic specific and interest specific. So the people that are gonna get this email today, so let's set it up. So I already set up that page, there it is right there. Now I'm gonna come in here to my communications and let's send out the email. So the email is gonna go out. I click on my communications, come over here, click on broadcast. Now you have sequences, you have list, you have lists, that's one thing. Those are all people on your list, okay? Now, the people on your list need to get emails from you. They're either going to get emails from your sequence, that's your email autoresponder. You have a handful of emails that are set up to go out automatically when people opt in. That's your sequence. Or if you just want to send out a random email, like today, I just made a random YouTube video. Yes, it's part of my schedule, but I didn't know the topic. I didn't know exactly what I was going to talk about just yet. It was a random, you know, thing. Videos up, now I'm gonna come in here and randomly broadcast. So a broadcast is when you randomly just one off, you just send out an email. 
just like sending sending a text to to your to your friend you know what i mean same thing with email that's the broadcast where you just send a one-off and let that thing go out and you can send it to multiple lists you can send it to one list you can send it to all lists whatever um this one is the top five replies okay so category is going to be digital agency blueprint that's the email category so i can start tracking all of that as well um and this is how we set it up this is how we set it up okay so we come in here broadcast and we're going to send by email okay and it's going to come from digital agency blueprint okay digital agency blueprint that's where the send that's where it's coming from and if anybody wants to reply they can reply to that email as well it's coming from the Kartra gateway right it's coming from Kartra Kartra sending it Kartra is the email autoresponder but it's looking like it's coming from me right it's not coming from a Kartra email it's coming from me if they reply it's coming to me so that's digital agency blueprint and then I'm gonna send it to only the people subscribed to a specific list which is digital agency blueprint i click add and then it's going to tell me that there's 81 people on that list two of them are blocked and what does it mean by block some leads might be blocked because of a number of reasons they flagged your communication as spam or their email bounced as invalid or they did not grant you permission to email them okay now make sure your shit is legit, man. Make sure the people on your list are legit. Don't just spam people, okay? These two people, whoever they may be, they're for sure their email was wrong because it's not from spamming. You know, they all opted in and they all double opted in, you know, um, willingly. So I know they're not reporting me to spam. So it's probably their email is wrong. No big deal. So save and next. And then we're going to single email it. And this is the email so we can go into tech and basic this is basic text where I can copy the name bring it over here and I can just write basic text and if anything I can I can link some words take them to a page I could do that for sure through basic through the basic uh, um, format or I can go in and I can do advanced and then the advanced is what I use because I have a template in here that I that I saved and that I just use for everything Okay, and, and I have it because it has my little copyright thing down here and it has my platforms. So I use this as the template. So here's what I do. I'm gonna just write something basic, man. We can use, um, and I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put, hey, and then first name. So there's their first name right here. I like to call them out by their first name. Hey, Jack, I just dropped a new video today today on my YouTube channel channel talking about the top five replies I get every single time when direct messaging for clients check it out here hope you enjoy it oh and by the way oh and by the way comment on any of my youtube videos and let me know what else you want to learn. I'll make a video and I'll make a video and chat soon. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. Okay, so that's a simple email, you guys.
and what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply link this to my page. So it's this page right here. And there's my URL. I don't care to customize it. It doesn't need to be my domain. It can be, it can be, but it, I don't care. It doesn't matter. It don't matter. It don't even matter. That could be my custom domain up, at, up, up there at the top, but I just, I just use the Kartra uh, default one. No big deal for this in this case. So I just implement it, embed the link there. Okay. And I'm going to maybe bold this word right here too. And then I'll link it here as well. I'll link it there. And that's that. And then, hey, Jack, I just dropped a new video today on my YouTube channel talking about the top five replies I get every single time I direct message for clients on social media. Check it out here. Hope you enjoy it. Oh, and by the way, comment on any of my YouTube videos and let me know what else you want to learn. I'll make a video and have it up ASAP. Chat soon. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to now add a subject. So let's go back to um, let's go back to um, dynamic variables, and then I'm going to get their name. Check check out check out. Hey Jack, or no, I'm going to check out. Actually, I won't use their name because I'm already using their name below. That's fine. Check out my newest video check out my newest video okay and i'm going to leave it like that you guys i'm going to send a test email okay let's send let's send a test email it should be coming to this one right here There it goes there. Bam. Check out my newest video. Okay. And so here's how it works, you guys. Hey, Tess, I just dropped a new video today on my YouTube channel talking about the top five replies I get every single time I direct message for clients on social media. Check it out here. Hope you enjoy it. Oh, and by the way, comment on any of my YouTube videos and let me know what else you want to learn. I'll make a video and have it up ASAP chat soon. So watch here. Check it out here. So they click here and then boom, it takes you straight to the page that I just cloned and I just created. So I keep using this page template over and over and over for my email broadcast. Why? Again, as I mentioned, so I can keep your attention on that video and so I can get you over to my affiliate link and so I can Facebook pixel you. That's why I take you to a page. And so that's how I do it, you guys. That's how I send out the broadcast emails. So let's finalize this. Email went through successfully, and I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna hit um, at the I'm gonna come down here and I'm gonna hit save and next. And then I can add any automations. If they open the email, subscribe them to the new list. If they don't open the email, unsubscribe them. I can add so many different automations, but I, I don't need to right now. And I can schedule for later, I can save as a draft and get back to it later, or I can send now. And I'm gonna send now. So your communication will be scheduled to go out within the following minutes. Save and next. Yes. And that is it, you guys. That is it. And then I can come in here to analytics. I can click on broadcast and I can track everyone who opens it. Okay. So super powerful, you guys. You're going to get people on your list for whatever reason. They opted in to get your free guide or free PDF or free video training or free course, whatever the hell you're giving out for bait. They get on your email list and then they need to be on your sequence, which is your email autoresponder. You should have some type of email autoresponder set up that go out automatically. On some of my list, I have up to 20 emails that follow. So you opt in. I already have 20 emails that are already lined up to go out every other day or go out every three days or however I have it set up, which is three days. I have it set up where it goes out every three days and, and you're going to get 20 of them, right? That's an email sequence, man. You want to set those up. But again, when you have random one emails that you want to send out, 
those are super effective as well. That's broadcast, okay? So I just sent out a broadcast email. Um, this is for all my, all my friends out there that are on my digitalagencyblueprint.com list. Those are folks that want to learn how I built my agency and what exactly I do to get clients and what I've been doing since 2016. And um, so if you're interested in any of that, make sure you're on that VIP list. You'll be getting broadcast emails like this from me. Uh, regarding what I'm doing and, and what's working and what's not, you know what I mean? So digitalagencyblueprint.com link is pinned below and it's also in the description. Get on the VIP and allow me to teach you how I'm building my agency and, and what I got going on. All right, you guys, so I'll see you on the next video. Hope that helped. Over and out.